and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Today we're talking about what happens when you complete all the mysteries, you collect all the wealth, which is the Ymir's Tears, in Jotunheim, in Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So, basically, after you've done all of that, there are a lot of tears. I believe there's like 31 of them or something around that kind of mark, and there's about 8 or 7 mysteries. Now, these are the hardest tears to get in the entire game, because every single one of them is locked behind a really difficult place to get to, and it seriously takes a lot of searching, finding, and doing like a great many Odin Sites challenges, like when you find those places where there's like glowing yellow stuff floating around you, and you're like, what the hell? You have to actually use your Odin Sites and look for kind of like these wooden statues and like skulls stuck to the walls, and if you press Odin Sites and you walk between that, it will make stuff change in your environment and then that will kind of really mess mess with your head and like change everything around you and you'll be like okay I don't really get why this is in the game it's so confusing it's the same method that you use to make the treehouse in that one mission where you actually have to go back to the treehouse and there's only a tree and there's no houses and you're like what and that's basically how you have to do all of those things you have to use Odin Sight and find these special kind of like wooden skulls like stuck to like walls and stuff almost like it's a like a secret gate, like some demon gate, and you gotta walk through them and, and do some stuff, right? Now, the final mystery that you can do is obviously only accomplishable once you have completed or collected all of Ymir's tiers, which is all the wealth in, in the entirety of Jotunheim, so that's every single yellow marker on the map before you can finish the lost blue one, which is located right here at Ager's Hall, if that's how you say it, Ager, Ager, dude, I don't know how to pronounce these Norse words, they're so difficult to, to comprehend, and we're at this altar right over here, the altar, right, so we can offer our 33 Ymir's Bloodstone. So there's 33 of them. You can see we've completed all the wealth, we've completed all of the mysteries except for one, which is obviously the one that we're currently on. And we're going to see what reward we get for making this offering. This final offering of collecting all 33 of those goddamn Ymir's tears, which are so super difficult to actually find. Honestly, you could probably do half the map in the normal Valhalla or England, quicker than it will take you to actually find all the Ymir's Tears in Jotunheim. No joke, like, I'm not even kidding. It's actually that hard. And it looks like we've finished the Offering Altar at Ymir's Altar, so that's great. All the mysteries completed, I feel great about myself. And all we get as a reward are another five skill points. Five measly skill points, guys which I'm going to go straight into my mastery for the bear mastery, which used to be capped off at 30, but now I can actually do even more of that. So that's new. That's something really new to the game. I didn't know that they were going to unlimit the amount of points you can put into these. Interesting. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in a future video. Thank you so much for watching.